Hi everybody. Well, I'm uploading this video to Easy Hack. Anyways, let's get started. I just found a webcam at Best Buy and it was way too expensive. So I went to Value Village and got a little Logitech webcam. I think it's like a 927 or something like that. Anyways, uh, first step is to plug it in to the computer. I'll put a screenshot of what the camera looks uh, like uh, later on during editing. So, in Kali Linux, or any Linux, open a terminal and make sure you have sudo permissions and type in lsusb. Now that's going to give you a list of everything connected to you, your USB port and what other ports they are. As you can see, my Logitech is Second from the bottom there is a Logitech Quick Cam Pro 9000. So that's a little better than I thought. So from this list here and with this command, we can see where the device is located. So we are on bus 001 ID 002064D and 0990. So we're going to have to use that information later on down the line but right now ls usb is the topic we are covering today so let's bring up the manual for that command so that's with man which i taught earlier in an earlier video l s usb now if that doesn't come up you just want to command ls because ls is the main command that we're using and usb is an option Look, it worked. So, Linux USB Utilities. Description, LS USB is a utility for displaying information about USB buses in the system and the device connected to them. So, our options, we got VS, uh, V tells LS USB to display the detailed information about the device shown. This includes configuration descriptors and the device's current speed. The class descriptors will be shown when available. For USB classes, including hub audio, uh, HID, so human interaction device, and communications, the chip card can be used with the T option as well. So I always use the S, because so, that shows what's connected to all your buses. And another good option is V, which would print all the version information on standard output and saves them to a log. So you can go back later on and cut and copy if you're into cut and copying your commands instead of typing them and learning them. Anyways. So, for easy hack out, I think this is a little great way on to tell what you have on all your ports. Take care and stay COVID free. Adios amigos.